Hi, I'm Nashville recording artist Rachel Holder. Like everyone else, I'm always on my phone, either texting or talking. <laughs> Let's face it, I love my phone. But when you're texting, you can't pay attention to the road. So the next time you need to send a text message while you're driving, please pull over because there's no text worth a human life. To get a free Don't Text and Drive thumb band, download my free mobile app, but not while you're driving. I'm Rachel Holder, and I want you to be safe. With your local and area news, I'm Justin Mott. Yesterday, there was a gas leak at the Southwood Apartments and Center. The Center Fire Department quickly responded. Center Fire Chief Keith Bindham gives us the details. We received a call about 11.45 of a gas leak at the Southwood Apartments off of uh, Old St. Augustine Street. Yeah, we responded down there. Some contractors were uh, putting in a new fence around the apartment complex when they uh, hit a gas line with an auger. They had called in for a line locate, but uh, they did end up hitting the line. We responded, stood by uh, with uh, the gas company and said everything was safe. It was running back to station about 12.45. There were no injuries or property damage reported. And in other news, and we here at Center Broadcasting Company have our 39th annual Take a Kid Fishing Day Brim Tournament coming up this Saturday, May the 13th at the Huxley Bay Marina. Early weigh-in is at 10, the last weigh-in is at noon. Once again, it'll be held this Saturday, May the 13th at the Huxley Bay Marina. And for more information on this, you can visit our website at cbc-radio.com. That's cbc-radio.com. Also going on this Saturday, the Helping Hands are having a food pantry at the Hillcrest Baptist Church at 9 a.m. And the Walking Builder Awards will be held this Saturday, May the 13th at 6.30 p.m. at their Masonic Lodge. Now moving along in your school news, going on at Shelbyville ISD, they're going to have Ryan Moore Field Day tomorrow at their elementary school with a balloon launch to follow at 11 a.m. At Joaquin ISD, they're going to have a meeting next Monday, May the 15th at 5 p.m. at their administration building to discuss their participation in some federal programs for the 2017-2018 school year. Going on at Center ISD tonight at their high school, they're having their Center High School Award Night. Now moving along in your sports news, the walking Lady Rams softball team is going to take on Big Sandy in Game 1 of the playoff series starting tonight at 6 p.m. at Jasper High School. The walking Rams baseball team will take on Groveton tonight at 7 p.m. in Game 1 of the playoff series at Jasper High School. The Shelbyville Dragons baseball team will take on Love Lady in the best of two out of three series. Game one is going to be played at the Morris Frank Park in Lufkin tonight at 6.30 p.m. Game two will be held Friday at 7.30 and game three will be played this Saturday at 1 if need be. Now keep in mind that due to weather, any of these game times could change. This has been your local and area news.